Ito ang masayit na katotohanan sa boxing. Nig nig ka. Um, and let me know kung agree po kayo sa akin dito, ha? Biruin mo, guys. <clears throat> ang daming mga magagandang laban. Yung talagang match. iba Yung mga boxing fight na match. Na yung mga fighters po mismo parang uh, magkakadikit eh. Magkakadikit yung kanilang uh, records. Pero yung laban po ni Francis Ngano at ni Anthony Joshua ang dinadagsa. At ini-sponsoran po na mga mayayaman. Bakit? Nagtataka, magtataka ba kayo kung bakit? ba diba? So, does it mean na it's not really the skills of the boxers that we're paying? It's not really the skills of the boxers ang bumibenta. Hindi kailangan ganun kagaling ng boksingero. Siyempre, maganda kung magaling ka, pero mas maganda kung sellable ka talaga. So, the matching today, they're not matching it by skills. They're matching it by popularity. They're matching it by popularity. I mean, just imagine Conor McGregor versus Floyd Mayweather, di ba? Ito, 0-1 fighter against the world champion, Joshua. And come, come to think of it, guys. This is what's happening these days. And we gotta admit it. I'm not saying that I'm, I'm, I'm against it. But it is the situation right now sa boxing. And, you know, in, in boxing world are catching up. To the YouTuber style or the blogging style, marketing style. Sa Pilipinas, they need to realize that that's the case. Look at look at uh, Casimero, di ba? Yung hype niya. Um, but pero hindi naman kailangan lagi ka mga away. Just look at you know, yung mga sikat na yan. You know, hindi naman sila palatrash talk lahat, eh, di ba? But you know, they have charisma. But this is what's happening in boxing these days. Guess that's why si Jake Paul mas malaki ng kita. Kaysa doon sa lumaban na ng 50, sa 30. Di ba? I mean, think about it. That is what boxing is today.